all right folks it is day 79 and uh oh it's like 7 30 a.m i uh brought the scale in here in my uh, studio because i'm tired of waiting in that tiny bathroom i already know my weight i just got done checking the scale to see if it would weigh the same in there or the same in here as it would in there because I do have a little carpet in here but I got that indoor outdoor carpet in this room so basically it's uh, it's just covering the hardwood floor <laughs> it's uh, kind of like a, a hard rug which uh, I need to replace at some point because it's getting wore out over the years but uh this at least this means i don't have to weigh in in the tiny bathroom anymore all right so there's absolutely no change uh in uh yesterday and today uh which means the uh birthday party did not have that <laughs> big of effect on me even though I ate a cupcake <laughs> sue me right <laughs> uh, yeah I think I like this way in in here better than the tiny bathroom I think uh, uh, that's going to work out just fine for future way ins oh I am still getting woke up Got a big day ahead of me. I gotta get ready and dressed. Uh, doing a cookout barbecue for my friend today. And uh, I've been toying with the idea of just doing a reset day today. Uh, instead of, uh, you know, till tomorrow because uh, my plan was to do seven days of sub fasting, but uh, I really want to enjoy this day with my friends, so I think I'm going to. Uh, but I'm not going to, you know, uh, blow my eating window or anything like that. I'm still going to be within my uh, window maintenance for sure. Uh, but uh, I think I'm going to grill some food and just eat grilled healthy uh, meat and vegetables today which uh, should be about the same thing as eating a healthy sub I would think uh, I'm going to pick up uh, I wanted to do a, a Boston roast uh, for him but uh, I do not have time to prepare one now because it takes a really long time to cook so what I'm going to do is I'm going to, I've done this in the past, pick up a couple of turkey tenderloins and I've got me a meat uh, shredder and I'm going to shred that up and I'm going to make it into barbecue. Like I said, I've done that in the past. That turkey tenderloin is delicious on the grill and it doesn't take nowhere near as long to cook either. So I'm going to uh, make them some uh, barbecue out of that. Uh, and uh, I'm going to uh, get me some uh, summer squash, some straight neck, and some zucchini. And I'm going to chop them up into uh, round circles. And I am going to get like some onion and uh, some different vegetables to go in there. Uh, I might just do just the squash and the onion because that's good by itself I got a special way I prepare those on the grill I will show you that in the video uh, <laughs> uh, so uh, it should be a really fun and exciting day and uh, if I can get Andy my friend to uh, speak about me a little bit on camera uh, no one knows me better than me other than him <laughs> uh, so uh, it should be interesting at uh, what he may have to say uh, you know 
providing he keeps it clean, of course. <laughs> we'll see how that goes. All right, folks, so it is 10.36 a.m. in the morning, and uh, people are just now getting up in the house, so I'm going to go ahead and eat my other half of this Black Forest ham sub that I got yesterday. And I got veggies sticking all over to the top of it here. Going to be. Oh, sorry, little dog just barking. In the shadow. So anyway, we're going to go ahead and eat. Got to get my energy and strength up to run that grill. I'll be on my feet a lot. I'll be eating a little more in my window today. I'm doing my reset day a little early because I got guests coming over. So this may be the last time you see me eat any kind of sub until Tuesday. because I want to eat some of that uh, food that my friend from Wisconsin, well, my, basically my brother from Wisconsin, he's from South Carolina like me, but his wife is from up there and they brought stuff to put on the grill uh, that uh, they make up Midwest and uh, the Subway Subfest is not going to be practical for me today. So I am just going to stay within my eating window and I'm going to enjoy this uh, festivity while it's available to me because it may be another year or two before I get to see my friend again. So. This is why the... Uh, Intermittent fasting is so important. Sub fasting is just a tool that I use to slim down with. So, after today, I can implement this tool uh, later in the week. I'm going to have two reset days today and Monday, and then I'll get back on the sub fast Tuesday.
All right, so I'm just sitting out on my front porch. It is a beautiful day outside. I got my stuff clean. We're just waiting on them to get here. Oh shit, I better go look, you know. Uh, drove the company truck. Oh, there. Down so go get her. <laughs> go check on her, you know. Not cut the truck, my truck. Go my truck. Anyway, sure as hell, some kids standing out in the media in the middle of the road. Help, help, go, please, you know. Well, I'll put her in my truck and brought her back down to the guard shack there. I made her sit on the hill. Did you put 13 children yes. barefoot in like 40, 50 feet right. They're walking down the highway the, uh, in the middle of nowhere. I called Clint and said, Bully, told them to go get her. You know, but uh, we had to wait a while. This is just like Lauren. He called police. They might be an hour before he gets out. We ain't doing nothing. They show up. Anyway, they, uh, and, and, we're waiting on the cops. Oh. Somebody was telling me somebody was doing bad stuff. So yeah. She just decided to leave. She just grabbed her little bag and found some clothes in it and walked it. Yeah, she's like, yeah, yeah, she was saying the Oh, I thought you said she was there. She said she was all ripped up. Yeah, on the fence, we're all going. Walking, she was all ripped. She was all ripped. This wasn't the first time. Tell them about the time Mark took you to eat oysters. Uh, yeah, he told her that one. <laughs> it's, it's better when Mark tells it. Shepherd's pie. Hey, sheep's nuts. I'm not eating sheep's nuts. We'll use ground beef. Uh, not necessarily I could nuts. probably be persuaded to use ground lamb. But I ain't eating. All right, folks. So, uh, you see what happened was <laughs> nothing went as planned. Uh, we decided to do hot dogs. So hot dogs is what we done instead of uh, the other time. We did have a few uh, great old big pork chops on there that we uh, split up, you know, into different pieces and shared. Uh, we cut those up in, uh, into different pieces. And uh, so we had hot dogs and sausage dogs because uh, we had that smoked sausage on there. Uh, we used ho hoagie, bo <laughs> hoagie rolls. Uh, and you know we put the uh, chili on there and some of that uh, Maurice's barbecue sauce that I had the other week and uh, yeah uh, we might have you know had a few drinks as well 
Uh, so, <laughs> I went outside my window today. Uh, not bad, but within between five and six. So, I went about an hour in outside of my eating window today. So, not too bad. But, uh, we did have a few drinks, and uh, I am still uh, feeling the effects of those drinks right now as I'm speaking to you. Uh, I'm not, you know, overly intoxicated or anything like that, but uh, I want to be honest with my audience because, you know, I, I'm going to do that weigh in in the morning to see how bad this affected me. And uh, however bad it affected me, I really don't care. Like I said, I've had a really good week and uh, experienced plenty of weight loss. I'm, you know, because of, you know, yesterday with the birthday party and today, uh, I'm sure that is affecting my standstill. And we may even have a slight gain in the morning, but uh, y'all know me. You all know me who uh, watch me and believe in what I'm doing. That uh, I will correct this uh, over the course of the week uh, for sure. Uh, I'm going to do a normal weigh-in tomorrow. And I will not be following the scale all week like I did uh, this past week. Uh, I feel like the uh, sub-experiment uh, was a great success. And it helped me... Uh, throughout this week to finally break the 40 pound barrier of uh, weight loss and I think going forward into this coming week uh, I can push that even further so tomorrow I'm going to do the weigh in no matter what the results are we're going to accept them as they are that is going to be our point of origin of weight for the entire week um, <coughs> And then whatever weight loss results come uh, the next following Monday uh, will be the loss that occurred. Uh, I'm going to, like I said, have another reset day tomorrow. I'm going uh, to eat whatever in the heck I want, right? <laughs> and then uh, I may get back straight on to the subfast come Tuesday. Uh, I feel like I'm going to uh, I'm going to need it <laughs> after uh, having the birthday party and, and today uh, with the way things went today and uh, tomorrow's reset uh, I feel like I'm going to need to put the subfest back in place on Tuesday and follow that out throughout the rest of the week and that's uh, the way I am going to handle things uh, going forward into the week uh, still catching up on your videos uh, I got a lot of people's uh, content to check out and uh, comments to respond to uh, if I don't get around to all of that tonight uh, I do apologize um, I've just been <laughs> letting myself go to enjoy my friend's company and it's been so worth it to uh, have him down and uh, hang out with him and his uh, uh, girl Tina you know his is basically his wife they're uh, partners I, I, I love them to death uh, and uh, her kid Dawson he's he's really cool he's well behaved well mannered child uh, and uh, and he had his son, uh, Robbie, there with us. His youngest son. I think Robbie's somewhere uh, in his late teens, early 20s, somewhere in that area. But uh, I really enjoyed their company. And uh, I hope to see them again in the fall. We, we talked about uh, we're doing a, a me and uh, the group of guys that I detect with. We're going to uh, do a camping trip in the fall. And uh, I invited Andy to come along with us, so I'm hoping he'll be able to come down and uh, be able to do that with us. Um, 
I apologize for being so slack, y'all. Uh, <laughs> I will get myself together this week. I'm going to call it a night because it's 8.30 p.m. right now as of the recording of this message. So it's going to take a little while to get all this uploaded. It might not uh, pass YouTube's inspection until sometime after midnight because I've been currently struggling with that. Uh, with them so i'm gonna end it here uh you folks have a good night until tomorrow you have a good mm -hmm.